Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how to change your Google Chrome settings in regards to things like notifications, location requests, pop-ups, and redirects. Uh, that way you won't get harassed as much while you're going to your favorite websites. Um, so you might notice you're, you go to a website and it says so-and-so website wants to see your location so it could find you know restaurants near you and you could either allow or deny that or so-and-so websites wants to send you notifications for whatever nonsense they want to send you things about or you know another website will redirect you to a different page if you click on a certain part of it and so on so what you want to do is you want to go to the Google Chrome settings and then the privacy and security section so you could also just type it up here and if you don't know how to get to your settings by the way you just go to these three dots and go to settings and then you could click on privacy and security and then from there you'll have this site settings section so if you click on that right here it shows my recent activity so for Google Calendar, you know, I got I went to my Google Calendar and it popped up saying Google Calendar wants to send you notifications and so on and I said do not, so it added this to this recent list. And same with these two things here. And you'll notice I have this little arrow here if you click on that. You could kind of fine tune it to where, you know, um for location and camera, say so it can't access my location, but it can access my camera and microphone and so on, but you're not going to be doing this for each each website because that's going to you know get old quick and you could also reset the permissions if you go in there and you decide you don't like what you did so we'll go back there and then if you go down a little more we have location so like I said this is the same thing as up here with the Google Calendar want to know my location and you could click on that and you can see these are the websites that had previously tried to access my location and I said no so I put them in this block list and if I want to take them out of this block list I could click on the trash can and delete it so next time I go to that site it's gonna ask me again and then same thing you know if I want to click on the arrow button there it's gonna give you these same you know permissions that you could fine-tune one by one there but like I said you're not going to want to do that and here's the setting for just to turn the whole blocking thing on or off so I would leave that on otherwise it's not going to prompt you for uh, sites accessing your permission and then for notifications same type of thing here's websites that have asked me to send me notifications and I said no you can manually add websites if you want to or once again you could go through here and you know allow allow it so it'll take it out of this block list and then allow it to send you notifications next time you could edit it, which is going to you know, just change the website address there. And then, of course, you could remove it. And then here, of course, you could turn off or on the settings for it even asking you if it could send notifications. So I would leave that on. All right, and then we go back. And then we just go down to pop-ups and redirect is our final section here. So I don't have anything blocked. So here's, I got Amazon and UPS. I have allowed them to pop up, you know, not pop up ads, but pop up other parts of the web page, like for UPS, it wants to pop up. If you make a shipping label, it pops it up in a new window, so you need to have that allowed, otherwise you're not going to see your label. And same for Amazon, and once again, you could go in and do the same fine-tuning thing, or add sites here for allow, or add sites to block, and then, you know, edit and remove, and the same kind of thing. So once again, so once you're in privacy and security, you know, you go to the site settings, and then you'll have your recent activity and you'll have your three main sections here location notifications and then also pop-ups and redirects as both it's in the same settings there so you know just go through there and just kind of see what you got blocked and you know maybe you want to fine-tune some things or remove some things that you didn't mean to put in there and you know kind of get get your web browser working a little more smoothly and not harassing you as much all right thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe